hello from a very sunny, bright spring day in London. But whilst the sun might be shining, really the world is going crazy. And I find myself making a strange kind of video for this time. Uh, normally I make travel videos, but now I want to make a video about life and about having three teens at home who have just had to stop going to school because the schools have closed down and we don't know when the schools are going to open. Now across the world different countries are experiencing different and yet similar situations. We are not yet in total lockdown here in the UK but I fear that that may happen at some point in time but we are being told to self-isolate to keep our distance and of course that's hard on everybody. It's hard on me, it's hard on my three teens, it's hard on the elderly people who are all being told to stay at home so that they can separate themselves from this awful virus. Anyway, I have permission from the children to document what life is like for us. I mean, for now it's just really day three. It's Sunday, the school shut down on Friday at the end of the day. We're not even in a lockdown situation at the moment. We are just being told to self-isolate and keep our distance. It's called social distancing. Anyway, I'm gonna introduce my three teens one by one and we'll see how they feel now and I'll keep updating it at various times to see how they feel as the days progress. This is Gabriel, age 17. Gabriel. Hi, didn't see you there. <laughs> Do you think this will be wasted time? Do you feel scared that you're going to have to spend so much time potentially inside or locked away within the confines of our house you can look at it in two ways you can look at it as wasted time or you can look at it as uh, an opportunity and I, I've got an opportunity now to do things I wouldn't necessarily do I'm gonna have a lot of free time on my hands to um, to do things that maybe I wouldn't do before to educate myself I can keep on keep on studying I can watch TV series I can do like fitness stuff at home so I think I'll be fine Oh, well, that's positive talk. Fingers crossed that uh, you'll feel the same way in a week. Do you think you will feel the same way in a week's time? Yeah. And this is Gabriel's twin sister, Natalie, a budding musician. So, Natalie, how do you feel about having to have no school and stay at home? I feel annoyed, but it's okay. Is that all you can say? I feel annoyed. Aren't you angry? I mean, it's no one's fault, so there's no one to be angry at. But it is what it is, and everyone's in the same boat, so I guess you're not missing out on anything because everyone's in the same boat. And how do you feel like you're going to cope? Not very well. I mean, we'll see. We'll see. I think, I think the first week I'll be like, yes, we're going to do this. Quarantine. Woo. Let's do this. But then after a while I'll be like, let me go outside, but I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. And this is baby sister Hannah, who's 14. Are you bored? Are you worried? How do you think you're going to cope? Um, well, obviously I'm quite bored. I'm, I'm worried for the people who are at risk. I'm not really worried for myself. I haven't got an underlying health condition. I'm in, I'm in good shape, I hope. Um, and I think I'm going to cope by uh, just just trying to take one day at a time and trying to be smart about things. Are you scared? No. Not at all? Not for me, for others. Do you think we're going to drive each other crazy? I think you're going to drive me crazy with this filming. <laughs> There you go, you've heard from the kids, you've heard from me, and I will keep making regular updates so you can see how mum and the kids are progressing. I hope we keep getting nice weather, although it seems like the weather is laughing at us a bit because our lives aren't the same whilst the sun shines on. Anyway, I'm grateful to have a garden, so at least we can get some fresh air, especially if isolation proper and lockdown proper does happen. I hope this video has been helpful to you. If it has, please feel free to share it with others. I think it's good for us to all share how we're feeling uh, across the world because we are all in this together. So for now, so far, so good with the kids. So far, so good for mum. But I'll keep posting and see 
how we are in a few days time. If you've enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you soon. Bye.